Shantae Marie. I am going to be doing a review today over some sunglasses that I purchased from a company on Instagram. I almost said YouTube, but it's a company off of Instagram that you guys may have seen a lot. It's pronounced Key. I like to say Quay for some reason because to me that's how it's spelled, but it is Key Australia. A lot of really popular YouTubers here have been rocking their sunglasses, so I personally ordered the glasses because I just need frames that are big for my big ass head. So honestly, I had been looking at Ray-Bans at the sunglass shop and they were like 270 something dollars without my prescription in them. So I was just looking for cheaper sunglasses for spring break and for summer. And I found these, I purchased three pairs of them and they come in these awesome packages. The first pair I'm going to show are kind of my faves. And these are the Shea Mitchell ones which I didn't know that Shea Mitchell actually created this line. Um, they say it on the side. It says Key Australia and then it has Shea's signature there and the, the case that it came with is cool. It just pops open like this and then you pull out the glasses. I wish I would have done an unboxing but I was so excited to get them that I didn't think to do one but they are these black ones. I'll have all of the names listed in the bottom bar for you guys so that you can see them. And I'll also link their Instagram and their website for you because the, this pair is actually sold out pretty often. This was, I was shocked that they were on there. So I believe this set was called Vivian. I could be wrong. I'll make sure to have it all on the bottom as I said. But they're really pretty and I liked them because they're literally solid black. And also... I like that they're just huge aviators. To be completely honest, I was shocked when I got them because sometimes aviators are just too small for my head. But I also wanted to show you that it says Q Shea. And when I first saw it, I was like, what the frick is that? And then I looked at the packaging and it said Shea Mitchell created this pair. So I loved these black aviator-like sunglasses. The next pair I'm going to show you are actually kind of similar um, in style, but they are called Muse. I know for sure because they come in multiple different colors, but they say Q Australia and then it says Amanda on the bottom. I'm not 100% sure. I'm not 100% sure who they're talking about when they say Amanda, but these pop open the same way. And I actually got rose gold because I wanted rose gold aviators from Ray-Bans and they were just too small for my head. So these ones are pretty big. I like them. They're super freaking reflective. Uh, they're rose gold in color, but then on the sides, they're actually like, I don't know how to explain it. They're gold, but then on this little side, it's like clear. So they're pretty cute. On the inside, they do Okay, well, it's not showing up to you guys, but on the inside, the lenses look blue. It's so crazy, and I feel like one of the sets that I got may have been polarized as well, which is awesome. So that is the second pair, and the last pair, they open the same way, and these are called On the Prowl. They're freaking massive. <laughs> like, these are so perfect for my head shape. It's not even funny. If you need really big, like, travel sunglasses or you're really hungover and you like don't want your eyes showing, these are like, hey, I'm a celebrity, don't take my picture type of glasses. So I liked these. The only thing I don't like about these that kind of sucked when I got them is honestly the lens is like two-toned. They're really good quality for a cheap price. The pair of Shea glasses that I got did come broken and it was just the nose piece had popped off because the screw fell out but it was all packaged so nicely that I was able to find the, the screw. I had the screwdriver to just go ahead and fix it but I can definitely say that this was not an Instagram flop. These glasses came out exactly how I expected them to and if you guys want to see more videos of like Instagram hit or misses just let me know because I kind of like doing these videos. That's all I have to say for today. Until next time, I will talk to you guys soon. Bye, guys.